Hi everyone, it's Liz here. Thank you for joining me today. I just wanted to give you guys a quick update on my passport size pocket notebook. Um, I will put the link below of how I put it together. Um, but many of you have been asking to see what I've done so far, if anything. So um, I will show you what I've done so far. It is so fun to put uh, memories in this tiny little book, as you can see, it fits in my hand. Um, because I can just use the tags and I've also found that the journaling cards fit really nicely in there. So I've journaled in the back of this one and I've added a little card that I received from Patty Lang. She sent me a package of goodies. So I documented that. This is um, documenting a baseball game that uh, my family and I went to and it was just such a perfect night. Um, and we have a dome and the dome was open so you can see the night sky during the night and during the day It was just a beautiful sunny day. Anyways, I documented that again journaled in the back and then behind that I just did the digital ticket and I just put the digital ticket in the back so I can just keep that as a memory And here we had a trip to the cheesecake factory um, It's about a 45 minute distance from where we are right now and it's at a mall that I used to work at when I was younger so it was just so fun to go back and check out the restaurant as a family this uh, here um, I received some goodies also from Caroline from Caroline's craft tree and she has some amazing um, handmade goodies and I had to document that as well so just added some stuff to the little tag again journaled in the back so you can see um, I keep my memories sort of written in the back and I can kind of show you guys a little bit of it but it doesn't necessarily have to show all my personal stuff back there this one was a fun page i met with beth wallen hi beth if you're watching um, and we did a swap and of course i had to take pictures of what i received the um the tn that she made for me oh my gosh you guys anyways i will link that video below if you haven't seen it um so anyways i journaled in the back of that um because i wanted to keep that memory as well and then this one was um Genevieve Designs she um, she released a new template set up and I was on her design team before she mentioned me with this latest um, kit that she's put together um, that I inspired her from something I did for her way back um, last year so I had to document that because it was just so fantastic she actually sent me a copy of those templates and anyways so this one's like a little interactive and stuff but as you can see I'm keeping those memories it's a tiny little format I absolutely love how it looks I've yet to fill up a few more pieces and like I said you can use your um, journal cards if you don't you know want to make tags for them but they're so just super fun to use you guys anyways that was my quick share of this I have a few other things coming some of you have asked for tutorials so I'll be doing those as well Anyways, thank you for stopping by and I hope this gave you some ideas on how to do some journaling if you're stuck or are overwhelmed by the largeness of a page. Go little. It's so much easier. Anyways, see you guys next time. Bye.